Hi, welcome to my channel. My name is Tim. I'm a flooring and stair contractor and today we're out at one of my job sites and I want to show you or give you an idea how you can really dress up your wood flooring installation for basically no additional material cost. If you're doing it yourself, it won't cost you anything. If you're having it installed, of course, it's going to be a little bit of extra labor, but this is a way to really make a statement and change the look of your whole installation. So without any further ado, let's hit it. meant to be in the great outdoors forever free so I call them feature strips you could call it a border piece in the doorway you can call it a header but what it allows us to do is to switch directions with our wood now you don't have to switch directions you can just use it to make a statement and, and separate a room uh, just put them pretty much anywhere it really changes the look and spruces things up and in my opinion it makes a huge difference here is the first one here and we used it as our own kind of transition piece in order to change directions from the hallway to the room now I love switching directions going into another to other rooms I think switching directions really makes a huge difference and makes an impact on how the job looks overall now here's an example where we didn't change directions, we just used it to dress things up. We put a piece going across the hallway. We're going the same way. It's important to make sure you line your boards up on the other side. It wouldn't look good to have them not lined up, but it looks cool to kind of separate that hallway and just make a little bit of a statement there basically. Now and in the closets we're just going to switch directions and go that way now. Same thing, we carried it down. And we ran our even our little linen closets here on both sides of the hallway, a different direction. And then here is our office where we did our little switch of direction. Feature strip in the center. Direction change on the other side of the door. So within this one room, we're switching directions four different times. It really makes a statement and changes the overall look and spruces things up. The floor we're doing today is Naturally Aged Floors Medallion Collection. The color is Sunset Hills. It's kind of my go-to product for engineered flooring. It's a high-end engineered floor with not a super high-end price. And it really, really looks amazing. I love the quality of this wood. It has a huge 3 mil wear layer and it's just a really nice wire brush finish. It's a slight hand scrape, nothing, nothing overboard, but not that fake uh, laminate hand scraping that looks kind of obnoxious sometimes. This is just a subtle hand scraping, and of course it has a nice texture on it. Texture and hand scraping hides wear marks, so it's really important, I think, on a wood floor not to have that super smooth floor that's going to show every little scratch. This, this way, if you scratch it, they're really going to blend in. Now let me show you exactly how we do this. So we've changed the width of these planks. These are what we call our feature strips or headers that go in the doorway of all of our rooms. Now we've cut the groove off and now since we've cut that groove off we need to put a groove back on and that's what we're going to do with our router. We're going to make our own flooring basically. Just like new, it's like it's factory edge. And that's how we put a new groove in. Slotted blade. This is just a way to really change the look of your installation. No additional material cost. Obviously, if you're having it installed, it's going to cost you a little bit extra. But if you're doing it yourself, it's not going to cost you any extra. Just a little know-how. You have to have a router. You obviously already have a table saw, I hope, if you're doing the installation yourself. But the only additional tool you're going to need is a router with a slotted blade. And that's it. And you can change the look of your floor. Do something that maybe none of your neighbors or friends or family have. It gives it that different look. It really sets things off. I love it. I hope you love it too. If you found this useful, we're really trying to help grow our channel. And if you like videos like this, please help us to grow our channel by liking, sharing, and of course, if you already haven't, subscribe. Hit that notification button as well so you know when we put these videos out. That helps us more than you can realize. YouTube really doesn't promote us as much as we wish they did, so we need help from viewers like you. 
And if you like this, we also have a PayPal link below. We're trying to get some better camera and audio equipment, like the new Sony camera we're on today. If you're new around here, you're also going to want to check out some of our other content. We have lots of great videos on how to install wood, laminate, and vinyl floors, plus my favorite product reviews. I review wood, laminate, and vinyl, and I even put them head to head. I run them over, I dunk them, I smurge them, I do whatever it takes to find out which of these floors are best for you. If you haven't subscribed yet, I want you to take out your favorite floor and mallet. Smash that subscribe button so you don't miss any future content. And thanks for watching.